This is the city of Camrose wastewater treatment lagoons. Whenever someone in Camrose uses water by taking a shower, flushing a toilet, washing clothes, or doing dishes, they make wastewater. All those things that go down the drain, including human waste, toilet paper, soaps, food waste, and more, all have to be cleaned out before the water can go back into nature. The lagoons are a series of cells where the wastewater will move through from the first cell where the water is very dirty to the final cell where the water is very clean. The treatment process takes about one month. Then after it's treated, the water will be stored here for up to six months. Did you know that no chemicals are added to the water to help clean it? Instead, air is added, like bubbles in a big fish tank. The air helps bacteria break down and decompose the biodegradable waste. After the aeration, any solid waste in the water will settle down onto the bottom of the cell. This is called sludge. The sludge builds up and the cell needs to be cleaned out every two to three years. Rich in nutrients like nitrogen and phosphorus, which plants need to grow, the sludge is added onto farmers' fields as fertilizer. Cleaned water is released into Stony Creek twice a year in the spring and fall. The water is tested before, during, and after the release at the lagoons and again downstream to make sure it is safe for the environment. We can all help the lagoons work well and keep the Stony Creek clean by never putting non-biodegradable material down the drain. Fats, oils, and greases from cooking can clog pipes and are hard to break down. So is plastic, floss, and Kleenex tissue paper. Use more natural soaps with less phosphates and never pour harsh chemicals or medications down the drain. Everyone in Camrose can help reduce their wastewater and keep our creek clean.